So I literally just finished unpacking my one bag. And that's right, you heard correctly, one bag. I hate lugging around tons of luggage, so I try to keep it as lean as possible. All right, so we're going from the right to the left. We'll start out with my backpack, the only form of luggage that I currently have on this trip. It's a backpack from Oakley. It has tons of pockets all over the place, which is really handy. Keeps me pretty organized, especially when I'm running around the airport going through TSA, all of that fun stuff. Not to mention, it's also really lightweight. Next up, I have the jacket I wore while flying here, and it's a Carhartt jacket, pretty standard. It stretches, really comfortable. For when the weather dips down at night here in Mexico, I brought a hoodie. This one's really comfortable. It is from Gloveworks, which is a boxing studio. They have a ton of locations, but I actually picked up this hoodie at the one in Manhattan. For when hoodies are a little bit too casual, I brought this track suit bomber type jacket top. Um, it's from One Piece. It has the logo tape on the sides. Next up, we have a pair of joggers from ASRV. The cut is really flattering. The quality is superb and the material is just on point. It's just very comfortable. And the last thing on this rack are a pair of denim shorts from Wrangler. Next, we have underwear. We start with Calvin Klein, Derek Rose, Hanro, Dolce & Gabbana, and more Derek Rose. In the second closet, we have two bathrobes that just came with the hotel. I brought a Burberry polo, um, just in case I want to step it up before stepping it out, if you know what I'm saying. Then I have a Salty Crew graphic tee. I like the colors. I thought they were just fun for a summery type vacation. Then I have a Von Dutch shirt. Next shirt is from Jack and Jones. I really enjoy that strategic tie-dye job with the stripes. I thought that was really nice. Next, I brought a Gucci shirt. This one's really lightweight and perfect for those warmer, humid climates. And there's something about wearing white in a tropical area that's very aesthetically pleasing. And the last shirt that I brought on this trip is a graphic shirt from Seoul Angeles. It says après ski, which is French for after skiing. I thought it was pretty appropriate because I just flew in from a place that had winter in full swing, tons of snow, and now I'm here. Lastly, I brought a lacrosse penny for when I work out. And onward to shoes. I brought three pairs. I have one pair of flip-flops from Givenchy. Sorry, I already wear them in the sand, so they're a little sandy. Then I have these guys. Um, I don't remember who makes them or or what the style name is. I've had them for so many years, but they're literally my favorite shoe because they compress to nothing because they're just canvas on top. But they're really com comfortable. They have arch support. I take them anywhere with me and everywhere. I probably It's probably time for a new pair, but again, I definitely got my money's worth with these guys. And lastly, I brought a pair of Yeezy 700s. This is the final stretch of my closet tour. I have this trucker hat from REI. Do you ever do that? Just go to a store and impulse buy something before a trip because that's what that hat is. I also have my swim trunks in this bag and they are from Vilbequa. And then in this drawer, you'll find the sunglasses. We'll start out with a classic pair of aviators from Fendi. Then we have the Celine Shadow. It's a cool color combo. I haven't really seen this in too many places. Then we have a pair of Chanel's, a um, little logo mania happening on the temples. And then lastly, we have a pair of Gucci aviators with a blue flash lens. Fun fact, they didn't start out with these lenses. I actually had them custom put in. The original lenses were very light and transparent. You could see right through them. They were almost like an amber color. They were cool, but um, I opted for these blue lenses. I knew that I would wear them a ton more. And that concludes my vacation closet tour. I hope you liked it, and hopefully I'll see you in my next video. Peace!